So in this video, I'm going to show you how to use the visualizer. So visualizer is where you can save the shot history and then you can also see the other people's shots. That's really popular like feature. It's cre created by Miha, who is the user, Design Express Machine user. So let's go. Firstly, you need to go to the setting, app, and extensions. And you can see there is the visualizer. I'm moved to visualizer. So you need to check this one to activate it. And then you need to go to the setting. And if you see here, you can see the username and the password. And this is just default and it doesn't do anything. So you actually need to create a user account on the visualizer. And if you go back to this page, you can see the website. So you need to open the Chrome and then go to the website and then create your account. So from here, I'm going to go to open the Chrome and then There you go. And then there is sign up. And then if you go down, there is sign up as well. Sign up and you put your email address. It's not, not my password for the email, but I'm just going to use this one like this. Sign up. So this account is created. And then now we need to go back to the app and then input your uh, email address and password in there. Go to the visual logger and then go to settings and put your username. So mine is the password was QWERASTF. And then the auto upload is automatically like activated. And minimum shot seconds to auto upload is six seconds. So if the shot didn't go for like six seconds and stopped, then it won't be updated. But if the shot goes for like six seconds or more, then it'll be updated automatically to the visualizer.coffee. So done, done, okay. And then it's automatically, I exit the app, then restart it, and then let's try it. So I'm gonna do the shot more than six seconds. I've done like nine seconds, and then I stopped it. And let's see if it's unloaded from the visualizer website. Tap your shot. Oops. Do, 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 do. Yeah, your shot. Nothing is unloaded yet. So the profile I've just run wasn't unloaded because the profile was cleaning or calibrate. So I actually need to change the pro profile to the one that I can really unload because the profile is untitled untitled 36 but it's based on the cleaning profile so I may go to the um, anything anything that's based on shot like making coffee not based on cleaning or calibration so this is based on the shot so if I do this one for more than six seconds there you go it should be unloaded Let's check again. So let's click your shot. There you go. So this Cremina lever machine is unloaded. This is what I just used. There you go. You can see the shot is exactly like the one that I just run. Nice. And if you see down here, there are actually more options for the graphs. So now it has like three graphs on there and there is like the temperature graph. But if you see here, there is resistance, but we don't really use it. So you can just skip it. But water dispense, this is the amount of water that I used for the shot. So you can see there is total water dispensed 9.87 milliliters. And you can deactivate it and then you can check the total weight. So this is the real time weight per seconds, but this is the total weight that I like, extracted for the shot. But this one, I just run the like simulator app on Windows. So 
I didn't really extract it, but it says like 4.6 grams. So that's the total of this weight line. And there is temperature. Yeah, there is not like the options as well. So that was the how to use the visualizer.